Yeah, I haven't, haven't done this in a while. All right. As you can see, I am no longer in my house. I am off in college, uh, you know, doing my thing, uh, not really paying attention. So for the title of the video, uh, I, you already saw it. I got a, a big ass fucking boohoo man haul. Um, yeah, I think I spent like, I think $240. I'll put, probably put the thing there. If I don't, I'm just lazy as shit. I'm not, I'm not going to try it. Like this day has been absolutely horrendous because of these packages. So basically one package came maybe like two days ago, which was Tuesday. And then today the people at UPS, they were cool. They were cool as hell. They basically said, Hey, we're too lazy to send this to you, to your dorm. Uh, you should just like come and just pay a, a fucking price. I had to pay $50 to pick up that package. $50 just so I can get everything like so yeah they kept in it was in two separate packages and it's a lot of stuff it was like 20 20 things by the way if you hear an echo I'm sorry this room is absolutely empty and there's nothing on these walls I didn't try I'm such a minimalist but yeah so this video is about uh, boohoo man and my thoughts on it so yeah but first I want to show off the beanies I got from bodybuilding.com they had a sale Literally, it was like 70% off for both of them. So now, as you can see, I I wear beanies. Literally today, uh, there was a there was a thing on Yik Yak, and it was it was about me saying I look cute with my with my beanie and like the jacket. I'm like, damn, like you know, I felt myself. So you know, I'm pretty sure it's the beanies, but I, I don't know, man. All right. Oh, what the fuck? This shit. Oh yeah, I forgot. Bodybuilding.com always like comes with shit. Damn, DoorDash 10% off. Bought two things, huh? I think it's because like both the different beanies, but I mean I'm just gonna open them real quick. You know, such like minimalistic ass beanies, but that's when you know they're good. Uh, they say like they have the bodybuilding.com logo. I mean, I like them. Just off by a feel, I'm gonna put them on. I'm gonna take. Don't. Don't say anything about my hair. It's always bad because I always have to fucking wear hats. But look at this shit. That's bad. Damn. Oh, that fits like crazy. That's not gonna fall off. All of my beanies that I have, they literally fall off. Every single freaking time I do something, working out, literally just in class, on my bed, just like laying down, it always comes off. Here's the gray one. Damn, that gray one looks crazy. Yeah, I'm gonna, yeah, this is definitely one I'm gonna rock. On a, on a different note, I'm looking kind of saucy in that, in this. I'm using the front-facing camera. I don't really care how bad the quality is. I'm not gonna try. I left my tripod in my car. I'm not going to my car. I, I will literally not. It's, it's maybe like 10 minutes from my car and back, maybe a little bit more. I'm still not gonna do it. But yeah, I mean, these hats are looking crazy. Probably gonna be breaking down every, oh shit, I <laughs> hope. I'm probably gonna be breaking down every single thing I got. Uh, by groups, so I think I'm gonna start off with accessories. All right, so I'm gonna start off with, I don't know if you guessed it, but I got a fuck ton of beanies. So first one, here's a, a wool one. I needed a cream color. I have a lot of cream color stuff. And if I had a hat to match it, I was like, dang, like this is definitely like when I, should have for my outfits and stuff. Um, yeah, I mean, let's try it on. Oh. I mean, it's all right. Like, overrated as fuck, in my opinion. I mean, it's not like that. Actually, no, you know what? The more I look at it, the more I, I look pretty good with it. Um, so, before I keep on going, I was gonna... Uh, I was gonna talk about why I choose Boohoo Man. So, I knew about Boohoo Man since, like, all the collaborations they've done. Like, with Larry Wheels, Eddie Hall, uh, Lil Durk. Uh, and I'm pretty sure... Uh, what's, 
what's his name trippy red yeah they did a collab with each other and i was like oh that's pretty cool and then like a long time ago i actually like checked the website and i see like everything's like really cheap i think it's just like, like a marketing thing but because like everything it's only is on sale it's definitely like a marketing thing but i mean yeah i mean that's why i chose it i mean because it's cheap i'm a college kid but i definitely went off <laughs> you're about to see all the stuff i get but yeah i mean this cream color hat i like i'm gonna try to i'm gonna oh shoot that hair is horrible i'm so sorry you know i just like just make fun of me if you want to uh, it's it's really bad so here's another beanie um oh this one's kind of weird this one's you're kind of forced to wear like this um so here's a purple one i have these like purple like anime shorts and i needed a purple well i didn't need it but i kind of wanted a purple hat to match it because you know it's beanie season i want to have like everything for every freaking outfit and then yeah so i thought a purple one would fit pretty good um I mean, it doesn't really like cover the ears. I don't think it's supposed to now that I think about it. But I mean, I, I kind of like it. I'm sorry, the thing is right here. Like I said, I didn't bring my tripod and I'm not gonna go and get it. But yeah, it's, I mean, it looks pretty good. Uh, on the camera, it doesn't look as purple as it is like in person. So, I mean, I, yeah, I like I like it. Here's beanie number three. It's literally the same design, but it's green. Uh, so my team colors. So if people didn't know, I'm, a, I'm on a powerlifting team. Uh, green Mountain Strength, and then we're like a, our colors are like green and black, and I need I wanted something that like could really match it, because uh, I have a shirt with it, uh, with a, uh, a shirt for my team, and yeah I think this is gonna match it pretty well. I mean it's the same design, but I'll just put it on. And... Pretty good. Well, the last two things with the accessories are things that I kind of wanted to try out. Uh, one of them is like a thing that I would really see myself trying out and it's rings uh, yeah I mean uh, I saw them and they look pretty sick uh, I'll just show them like individually oh here's like a skull one that one looks freaking sick uh, here's like the snake pattern one I this looks pretty cool and then there's this this one I mean it's just like a chain link design nothing like too crazy so I got me the medium and large size so I hope these fit but we'll see I don't know which one's my like, fattest finger. I mean, my thumb is, but this one's a little, a little too big, not gonna lie. Hmm. I mean, I guess the the skull one's kind of too big, not gonna lie. But I mean, they're kind of cool. I uh, don't know how I would wear this. Damn, I kind of, this is the one I really wanted to fit. I should have. Check out the small ones. I thought. Sorry, there was a little fucking uh, low power mode. Um, yeah, I mean, I thought my fingers were going to be really fat. I guess not. So I mean, this doesn't fit. But I mean, oh well, I don't really think rings are kind of my style. But I just wanted to try them. No. Uh, but I mean, yeah, they're pretty cool. I mean, they were $6. Like, you can't really beat that price, you know. Oh, and the beanies, they were like like maybe six to ten dollars i'm not sure i got to like check through so these glasses i saw these glasses and i'm like damn that's kind of sick so they're like really thick ass lenses they don't feel like cheap they're like kind of like like silver maybe it's like aluminum nothing not like crazy you know but yeah i mean these look pretty cool Let's see how i look in them though oh i gotta take these off You can't really. Nah, that's 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 crazy. That's crazy. Not gonna lie, I I fuck with it. Let me put this like tag back like this. I mean, I fuck with it. I don't know about you guys, but yeah, I fuck with that shit. Let's see what it looks like if I put on like a beanie. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's kind of saucy. Not gonna lie. Fuck. I look like uh, what's his name? Uh. Lift center. I look like lift center. Yeah. All right. So that's done with accessories. Now let's go on to uh, graphic tees. I gotta hurry this up because the low power mode showed up for ten percent, and also my video. Uh, 
I don't have that much space on my phone because all the lifting videos I have to record. By the way, uh, I am going to wear everything at the end of the video and show off some fits. So, I mean, I'm gonna try to put everything together, but you know, like that's gonna be a lot of outfits. So I'm gonna just get like a select few things, but yeah. I think the craziest one might be this one. Uh, let's see how to open this. So a thing that I started loving because of Russell Orhe, he used to have this like crop top he made of his old shirt and he would purposely like uh, bleach it to have that brown look. I thought that's sick. So I got a shirt like that. I don't know if you can see, see it that well. I mean, it looks pretty freaking cool. Then here's the back. It looks like a, one of those like tour shirts. I mean, I think it is. It's like for a band, like a, like a fake band, I guess. But I mean, it looks, it looks awesome. I freaking love it. That's gonna go well with a lot of stuff. Uh, so the so I after I ordered the stuff, I saw the reviews, and the one problem that people have been having is that the sizes of the shirts are like horrendously awful. Uh, when I looked at this, honestly, I think it's gonna be a little too big. I should have got small. This is a, all these shirts are medium, so I might have goofed up, but I don't think it's my fault. It's honestly their fault for not really putting the size guide that well. And I mean, they have a pretty good like thing, like a ask for your height, your weight, and like your size of your stomach. And I mean, but like, just because it asked that doesn't mean it's like really accurate because I mean, it, asked, it told me I'm a medium and then that looks kind of like massive. Needed a cream shirt too. And this one looks pretty freaking cool. Uh, I just like, like graphic tees like this. It just looks so awesome. Um, it's just like plain and simple. I mean, I, I just like that. Like, uh, I don't know how to explain it, but it just like, it's just creative, I guess. So, I mean, there's this one, nothing on the back. So this one, I am absolutely mad about. They freaking told, they, on the website, I might put a picture there. It looked purple and I wanted a purple shirt because the anime shorts I was talking about before, I needed a purple shirt for that to make that look sick, you know? When I got this, it, it was a navy color. It even looks worse on the fucking camera. Um, I mean, it's honestly kind of my fault because the thing did say navy, like the color said navy, but the picture was purple. I'm like, what the fuck? But, oh well. I mean, it looks sick though. I Like either way, even though it's navy, I don't really like navy, but this is the back. Like nothing's in the front, but this is the back. It looks freaking sick. I, I'm about to, I'm about to look fresh tomorrow at the gym, at school, bro, I'm, I'm telling you, it's gonna be crazy. Damn, this one looks kind of massive. Okay, it just says limited edition at the front and then the back. Oh, that's kind of sick. It has like a like a cream collar. That's freaking awesome. So I know the world is my oyster and I can reach for the stars. In a gentle way, I can shake the world. It's kind of fucking sick, not going to lie. It has like the, a, that really cool font. And there's this one. I need. I wanted like a blue color like this. This is freaking sick. I don't know if you can see that. Pretty sure, yeah, this is the back. The The shirt is like, uh, the front, it's clear. But this is the back. That looks sick. These these lifting days are going to be epic. Oh. And, okay, all these shirts were like about $12. They feel like a normal shirt. And that's not a bad thing. I love this quality of this shirt. I mean, so far, so good. I haven't put the shit on. It's probably going to be really big on me. But I really like oversized stuff. And it's an oversized t-shirt. So far, they look all pretty good. Yeah, this is another one. This is the front. Nothing on it. But this back is insane. This, I'm going to wear this with the shirts. Or the shorts, I mean. The purple shorts. Look at that. It's like a freaking dragon. That's sick as hell. Dude, you don't understand how hyped I am to wear this stuff. This stuff is awesome. I mean, I guess I'll just show off the rest of the shirts, I guess. I mean, yeah, I guess it's just like a upper, like top stuff. This is a long sleeve. 
color sick. I have actually I don't know what I'd put put the, with this, but like you know, it's just a normal plain shirt, the logo's in the middle, has stuff on the sides of the sleeve. I don't know if you can really see it that well. But yeah, it's like the limited edition stuff they do. And I mean yeah, it's pretty sick. That's freaking massive though. This is not a medium. These sizings are abysmal. <laughs> Maybe it will shrink. I hope it shrinks, but I don't think it's like 100% cotton. Maybe I, might, I could rock the, the lungs, like the long oversized stuff, cool as hell, but we'll see. This literally feels like a blanket. It's that big. All right, not gonna lie, I already don't like the texture. I hate the textures of this type of stuff. Like, uh, I don't really know how to explain it, but it's just like the plain, this like mesh quality. I never really like working out on that stuff. It always just feels scratchy to me. And it's just like, I don't know. I always just like working out just like normal, um, like normal, uh, what do you call it? Like shirts. Um, I do. I did get a pair that kind of matches this. There was like a different, there was two, like mainly black and then this cream color. I got that one. There was an, a mainly cream one with the black accents. I should have got that one. It would have matched this so much better. But no, I mean, I like it, so I mean, it's just plain and simple, but like the mesh, like I said, you don't really like it. But. Now, I brought it up in the video uh, at the start of the video. Uh, there was a collab with uh, with Larry Wheels, and you know I had to show my support. You know, oh, this feels good. Yeah, this feels. Video ra randomly decided to cut off. Uh, so not gonna lie, this is like a continuation, uh, like like two hours. Uh, because I thought I lost the video, but I guess I just needed to free up space and it just came back on my uh, camera roll. So we're gonna go back to uh, what I was showing off. And I'm pretty sure it was, if I can find it, the Larry Wheels cutoff. So, like I was saying, like prior, I think, or was it prior? Yeah, prior. I, I wanted to like support Larry Wheels. The When I saw that Boohoo Man and uh, Personal Record did a collab, I had to hop on. And one of my favorite things are like long ass, like the long sleeve, like uh, not long sleeve cut, like where the sleeve is like cut like really low. I love when that, because you show all the lat and rib. And I have pretty, uh, my ribs show, so it looks really aesthetic. I'm not really that fat, so it was not gonna show that many rolls, but yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, this is an awesome cutoff. Can't wait to use it in the gym. His uh, PRs, if you will. Those are the shirts. Now, let's go to uh, the sweaters. So I got three sweaters, right? First, I got this one. This one's kind of like heavy. I didn't think it was gonna be this heavy, but I mean, it's pretty cool. I mean, normal, normal in the front. Doesn't really show a logo. Uh, has two sides for the pockets on the, the front. I should probably get it a little bit closer. And has ones on the side. I, I thought the side ones were pretty, like, in a weird spot. I don't know what I'd put in there. Maybe headphones, but, I mean, can't go wrong with, like, extra space. And on the back, it says, the main, it has their, because uh, this is part of the active gear stuff, the main active. Looks really sick. Pretty good quality in the inside. I don't really like the, the outside as much, but I don't really like the glossiness, but the inside feels pretty good, so I'm happy with it. So for winter, I really needed a jacket, and I thought this would be thicker, but I guess it's not, but it's really insulated. Like, it feels like it's, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna be that cold. So, yeah, I got this jacket. Uh, has like this like jacket kind of pattern on the top right here, it's like probably like the, wind, the windbreaker stuff. And it feels just like one of those like just normal like quarter zips. And also here's like uh, side pockets. Pretty good depth too. So really like this jacket. I think this is the most expensive. I think it was like around $30. Again, I'm not sure. I got to look back. But yeah, I think it's pretty cool. And then last. So I got absolutely like catfish with this one. I thought it was going to be a different, like, design. Or not this. I mean, yeah, design. And also, like, a different uh, material. It's so weird. Like, 
look at this. Like, I, it doesn't show. It kind of doesn't really show in the camera. But it's so weird how I would describe it. You know, the like, for my Mexican audience or Hispanic audiences, you know that cloth that, uh, like, Hispanic families put their tortillas in? That's what it feels like. Like, it's not good on the outside. It's like, it has, like, a waistband thing at the bottom, too. And also, and also like, the inside. The inside's horrible. Remember when I was talking about the... Uh, the cutoff, like the mesh material, that's what it's on the inside. It just feels so weird. It feels like it's going to itch like crazy. So this one, I'm not really digging it. But, I mean, it's my fault. I probably should have looked at it better. But, yeah, I mean. And not to mention, it feels like 20 freaking pounds. It's heavy as hell. So, took a loss on this one. But, hey, Chris Foot or something like that. So, let's start off with shorts. I got these black shorts, or yeah, these black and uh, tan shorts, thinking that it really matched the cutoff. But I needed the other colorway, but I got this one. It's not that bad, actually. I, I love it. It's so, like, minimalistic, and that's how I like my shorts, and it's pretty a pretty good length. I think it's, I want to say, like, maybe 7-inch inseam, but I'm not sure. I gotta, like, stand up. It goes, like, basically above the knee. Uh, what I like to do is roll it up so I can have it up a little bit more and that's I, I think this is a perfect height or perfect length if you will. So these joggers it is so there's two categories I want to fall under right fat slash fuckboy fall all right and you gotta have the joggers when you're doing that so there's these black joggers right here you don't really like it's I don't know if taper is the word they taper at the bottom they don't really do that it has a zipper and i got mediums i feel like i should have got smalls because my the length of my legs but i can easily just roll these short uh like yeah roll these like the shorts and yeah i mean it's pretty good length uh i like how baggy they are they're not really too tight so they don't show off my ass <laughs> the ass is too too fat look at this these shorts are awesome i mean these joggers are pretty awesome i want to see this this is exactly the same one, the black ones, but it's a gray one. You know, you know, for fuck by fall, you gotta have the gray sweats. So yeah, I mean, that's pretty much everything. Um, so what I'm gonna do now is just, I'm gonna put on a bunch of the stuff and I'm just gonna just make, uh, make up some, some outfits. So yeah, uh, that's gonna be at the end of the video. It's gonna be just a quick, quick montage, maybe like clips and stuff. If not, like pictures. Honestly, that's not bad. In person, it kind of looks dumb, but I kind of... What do you mean in person it kind of looks dumb? I, like, I, like, I actually like this. Yeah. This might be gym fit tomorrow. Go for it. Yeah, pretty good. The same color, but different shades. If it doesn't... Somebody take your picture and I'm like, oh. I wanted her to post that one. Here's looking kind of weird, no kizzy, but it's fine. <laughs> that's just like that was just giving the sims like where they jump and spin in a circle and they change that's part of the video by the way was good is the aftermath of the boohoo man haul it's been a week since i recorded that video i've just been so lazy to edit it edit it but that's honestly a good thing because i've tried out so many of the outfits so i got the blue one with the with the is it vegeta or i think it's vegeta if i'm not mistaken 
But yeah, this was uh, today's workout and the workout was saucy and the whole just, when I put on a good fit, that workout is going crazy. But yeah, I put on a lot of the stuff and I have a lot of, uh, I want, I have points that I want to get across. One, the oversized shirts, they fit like how they should. I, I love how they fit. It's kind of like, it shows a little, it covers like most of the shorts and it shows off the legs. I freaking loved it. Number two, that cream sweater that said was, uh, that I got catfished on. Nah, that shit was fire. I, I loved it. Uh, when I put it on, it felt pretty good. And it, w it went well with like the joggers I put. And the third point, the joggers, man. If if you're a guy and you want to show off, you know, you, if you're packing a little bit, get those freaking joggers. Those joggers were crazy and they feel amazing. They look baggy, but when I put them on, they were tight on my legs and they showed literally every single part of my muscle on my leg. But yeah, I mean, after a week of everything, I think it was a success. I loved everything that I got. And yeah, I can't wait to keep on putting them on. And um, yeah, thank you for watching. I am so thankful for the, people, the fucking three people that are watching this. Uh, I hope you guys have a great day. And you, you might see me later. I don't know. <laughs>